is the first installment of the Beethoven series where I learn a new concerto, in this case, obviously, Beethoven. I'm spending quarter one of 2023 learning the Beethoven Violin Concerto. My goal is to do approximately two pages a week. So first two pages, let's go. <laughs> Okay, I wanna take a second and talk about this process. And, woo, my heart is still kind of pounding. It's so much fun to play this piece, and it's also, um, it's extremely compelling, but sometimes the desire to express, the desire to express, I sometimes translate as putting too much effort into my playing and that's something that I am working on. So my practice process for this week, I didn't have a ton of time to devote to this. I maybe spent 30 to 45 minutes a couple days this week practicing these two pages. 
Now, something I did that I think I'm going to keep, at least for the rest of this month, is at the end of each practice session, I recorded a run through. And then, before my next practice session, the next day, I made sure to listen to the run through at least once. And it was so revealing. I wrote down things I learned after each like practice recording. And I tried to kind of not get a long list, but instead each day improve what I noticed from the previous recording and make the list shorter based on what still needed to be improved. Uh, I will say for me, technically, the biggest challenge in these two pages is this extremely strong desire I have to express, coupled with very challenging technique and when I want to express, I often press harder in both hands. And it makes my job so much harder. This coming week, <laughs> I have not even looked at the next two pages, guys. Ooh, it looks like we do not have much going on. That's kind of nice. Looks like it might be an easy week, folks. I might need to do a third page. Um, a number of 16th notes on triplets, okay. Probably doesn't actually look crazy. I think the theme for this week, this coming week, and probably this month is going to be finding expression in the context of relaxed and released technique. Perhaps I'll use a metronome. That is something I will at least explore. I do definitely want to keep the recording um, of the two new pages. I want to keep doing that every day. It's so helpful for technical blind spots. Yeah, I'm gonna listen back to the recording from today and I'm gonna still hear a lot of stuff. So. <sighs> that is why it is all about progress, folks. It is not about getting it perfect. We, as a species, we humans, don't get things perfect the first time and we have to teach ourselves to keep trying and to improve a little here and there. I hope you tune in again next week. I'm looking forward to 16th notes and triplets and lots more Beethoven.